June 24, 2003. Storm chaser Tim Samaras is in Tornado Alley looking for trouble. This thing turned into a big gust front. His goal, to place as many scientific probes as possible directly in the path of a giant twister. The trick, do it without getting killed. The perfect conditions are forming near a tiny hamlet called Manchester. Tim and his teammates drive towards a massive thundercloud. About seven miles out, a funnel starts taking shape. Oh, look the he tries to get closer, but no roads lead in the right direction. Oh, let's, let's take this and go up and around. This is a dangerous storm. Take shelter immediately. I'm going to wait until I get right angle. Take cover now. He outraces the tornado for a few miles. And we took the road heading east, basically going right into the path of the tornado. One probe down, five to go. The chasers estimate it's at least an F-4 tornado with winds over 200 miles an hour. A twister this fierce can level a well-built house and turn a mobile home into a missile. Tim's probes will record wind speed, barometric pressure, and other data if the tornado sweeps directly overhead. The more he deploys, the better the odds. But playing chicken with a twister is a dangerous game. The tornado shreds a nearby farmhouse, a reminder of what 200 mile an hour winds can do. Still, Tim is determined to deploy the last of his six probes. Let's drop one more. We need to drop one. Yeah, we don't have time. Right? Don't have time. We don't have time. Seriously. Oh my God, he was saying that, but I was thinking something else. I was already out of the car. I got the probe, I put it on the ground, I jumped in, I deployed in five to seven seconds. Then suddenly, the tornado turns on them. It's coming back on the road. It's coming right at us too. We gotta put another one. Twisters can accelerate at speeds of 70 miles an hour. This one is only 100 yards away and bearing down fast. Listen to it. If it catches up, it'll fling their van through the air then crush it like a tin can. The driver puts the pedal to the metal, but the tornado seems to be gaining. The twister chases the van down the road, then at the very last second, veers away and loses steam. They escape unharmed. 